Were premature babies really displayed in Coney Island? Baby incubators were invented in Europe in the late 19th century. In 1898, Dr. Martin Cooney brought them to the United States and set up shop on the boardwalk in Coney Island. There were no neonatal facilities in the city, so mothers rushed their children from all over to be saved by Dr. Cooney and his glass boxes. People paid 25 cents to see the tiny infants. Dr. Cooney's facilities were approved by the health department and lasted until 1940 when hospitals began to develop their own neonatal wards. I'm Jean Ashton. I'm executive vice president of the New York Historical Society and director of the library.